well away from Scotland down to the southwest. In fact, we've got this little wriggle of low pressure that's moving up across the southern parts at the moment. It's already brought some wet weather today, and there's more rain to come through tonight and through tomorrow as well. Now, the wettest part this morning was down across the west country. Some heavier bursts of rain moved up from the south. And since then, that band of rain has become more extensive. It's pushed across south-east England too. There's some pulses moving now up into South Wales, the South Midlands, and across towards East Anglia. But the heaviest rain tonight is remaining down across the south. There's some heavy pulses still to come down towards the English Channel where it'll be pretty misty. Now, further north, clearer skies, still some showers across Scotland, but many of those will fade away as the night goes on. A few mist and fog patches developing across Northern Ireland, Southern Scotland, and parts of Northern England. That's where the coldest weather's going to be too down to zero to minus two degrees. There could be one or two icy patches up in the north where you've had the showers today. But otherwise, around these western coasts, temperatures three or four, and certainly no problem at all in this wet weather across the south, about four to six degrees all night there. So the weather tomorrow dominated by this area of low pressure, which will move very steadily northeastward across these southern counties of England and Wales, with its rain becoming more extensive and eventually pushing further north later in the day. A nice bright start for the north, though. Plenty of sunshine around for a good part of the day, in actual fact. That mist and fog soon clearing away, but the sunshine will become increasingly hazy up across Scotland and northern England, certainly, as we go through the afternoon. Outbreaks of heavier rain pushing across East Anglia, South East England for the afternoon, as it becomes a little bit drier in the southwest, but still very misty up over the hills. Some patchy rain crossing Wales, the Midlands, and eventually up into North East England, I would think, after tea tomorrow. Temperature-wise, well, it's going to feel a bit cold in the rain, of course, but generally speaking, 9 to 11, and that really isn't too bad at all for the early part of March. Well, tomorrow night, that low pressure anchored off the wash there. A new area of low pressure, or cold front, moving in from the Atlantic. That's going to bring some wind and rain across many parts of the country during Wednesday, followed in turn by brighter showery weather for Scotland and Northern Ireland through the afternoon. The rain band pushing onto the eastern side of England late in the day. And then a brighter prospect once we get through to Thursday. A good deal of fine bright weather about. Still pretty mild too, again about 9 to 12 degrees. But there will be some wintry showers across Scotland. Well, that's it from me. Enjoy the evening.